Well, the Prime Minister detailing plans for national development in his second national report to the nation last evening. He highlighted crime and education as key areas of focus, as Fern Carey tells us. The nation's leader, Prime Minister, the Most Honorable Dr. Hubert Minnis, sending a stern warning to criminals in his report to the nation Monday night in outlining the government's comprehensive plan to address crime and the fear of crime in the country. The Prime Minister said authorities will be relentless in their efforts to bring criminals to justice. Citing recent figures which show a reduction in serious crimes, the Prime Minister said police have stepped up their visibility on the streets while innovative crime-fighting technology will be employed and more resources allocated in the crime fight. We will be relentless in preventing and fighting crime. We will relentlessly track down those who do us harm. We expect approximately 130 new recruits to be trained this year, 100 for New Providence and 30 for Grand Bahama. This year, we will purchase 90 new vehicles for the police force. There are plans to install an additional 507 CCTV cameras throughout New Providence this year. This will bring the total to 750 CCTV cameras. And in an effort to safeguard the country's borders and reduce illegal migration, Dr. Minna says a radar system will be installed on Inagua. Our multi-layered security approach will also include drones and vessels. We will enhance our interception capabilities by decentralizing the dispatch of vessels in the southern Bahamas. We will expand base facilities to accommodate drone deployment. We are also improving our operational guidance capacity by engaging regional intelligence networks, inclusive of the United States of America, the Republic of Cuba, and the Turks and Caicos Islands. The Prime Minister says the country's education system will also be transformed to meet 21st century standards, and he indicated that digital upgrades are taking place within a number of schools across the country. An LCD projector were given to each teacher and an Amazon Fire tablet to each student. These devices are being used to support the teaching and learning process in preschools by providing students and teachers with technology that may help to develop and to enhance 21st century learning skills. Teachers and teachers' aides were trained in the use of technology devices and the VisperCast management system. The Prime Minister also outlined the government's strategy to reform the correctional system and develop arts and culture in the country. Fern Carey, ZNS Network News.